Would it be against the Geneva Convention to dress up POWs in bunny suits? Asking for a friend. I think it would depend on the conditions, right? If it's too hot or cold for it, that could count as torture. Don't they give difficult prisoners pink clothing to calm them? Could have a similar effect. Would it be against the Geneva Convention to dress up pals in bunny suits? Forcibly make young men go on estrogen. Their bodies change against their will as they turn more into women. Have to wear bunny suits entire time. Forced to work in the comfort shack. Officers reserve the right to create harems from the femboys they like most. Is this the future of warfare, bros? Forcibly make young men go on estrogen. Their bodies change against their will as they turn more into women. Have to wear bunny suits entire time. Forced to work in the comfort shack. Officers reserve the right to create harems from the femboys they like most. Traps aren't gay. The penis makes it better. War is hell. It's either the bunny suit or the latex detainment suit. The choice is yours. Looks like a legit way to restrain prisoners. Once again, K is proven to be best bored. Yes, it would count as sexual humiliation and harassment against them. Mexican military officials making cartel members cross dress. Be soldier. Shooting at days. End up captured. Wake up in bunny suit. Meal next to me. Eat. Get taken to what I think is the medical center. Get estrogen shot. Get estrogen shot every day. Become femboy. Forced to work in comfort shack. War is hell. Traps are in fact 200% gay. Can I volunteer even if I am not an enemy or prisoner of war? Fags not days what the fuck. If you already look like a femboy maybe. Also adding this. All the women are immediately forced to work in the shack. By that logic being with a regular basic woman is just as gay as being with a dude. It makes no sense. On a side note, I have always believed tomboys are the best choice. But I'm also half gay. Being a future interstellar war. Faster than light travel exists but communication can only travel as fast as the ships can deliver messages. Entire wars are fought in star systems where the general public doesn't even know has happened. You fight in one of these wars. Your unit gets captured along with the star system by then enemy. Uncle AI says sorry, nothing we can do Lomeo. Get transported to a planet where thousands, if not millions of pals are being housed. Get assigned punishment based off of personality that best humiliates you. Spend the next next few months slowly changing from a cold blooded killer to a frail femboy sex toy. Forced to wear degrading bunny suits and fully enclosing latex suits all day. Forced to service my former enemies. Finally get sold off into an interstellar slave trade network, before being sent off. Get life extending injections allowing me to live like this indefinitely. My face when I'll be spending the next couple centuries at least being degraded and abused by real men. Men that I used to be like. War is hell. Jesus that's even worse than what I were. Being so alpha that you force another man to become your bitch so hard that he literally turns into a bitch fully submitting to your rule. Homosexual. That is the most heterosexual thing I can think of. This. Imagining dominating a man so badly, winning him over so hugely, that he's now your bitch who has to do what you tell him to do. Bonus points if your PP is bigger. Holy shit you're right. It's not that basic woman is gay, it's more that they're generally undesirable when compared to the superior tomboys. That is the most heterosexual thing I can think of. I can think of. Incredibly delusional fag. We should delete this board to purge this thread. Spy. Guards arrest him. Private. Get the detainment suit. Regular girl interests 100% gay plus penis 100% gay equals trap 200% gay. Unless my math is wrong. It's 100% gay to be with regular women. Not because of their genitalia, but rather their interests. Either way it's just as gay as being with a regular dude. So K traps with estrogen shrunken micro penises are only 100% gay then? You never rub your cock on a tomboy's abs after forcing her to wear a bunny shit. A, let's say 150% gay. They make up for some of their gayness for liking guns, but they also like makeup and shit too so. I think the takeaway from this is we're all faggots. Dress them in pink and make them do anime dances. The warden of the Cebu prison in the Philippines makes inmates do anime dances. Anime dances calm them down. We are all kill eventually free endo. So fuck it. Let's dance. Okay, so, it's an idol group, but they're all prisoners. All wearing prison uniforms from different eras areas. This one is the meek tax fraud prisoner, that one got life for poisoning her ex. ETC. No, as long as it's a uniform and not demeaning or painful. Not a bad idea. 
Some bullshit UN official inspects your camp. They're shocked. There are five people in each cell, each wrapped in a black latex suit, with an IV drip and other tubes. Barge into office to see who's doing this. Man at desk surrounded by 20 or so 6 feet tall benigerals. Yes? What in God's name are you doing with your prisoners? We asked them and they chose that option. Why? They chose, where are the others then? All around you, see? Bunny girls all look away, blushing. Notices most have Adam's apples. We didn't have enough space for all of them, so we started using the confinement suits. Still, those that show a submissiveness are allowed to walk freely. What? Actually this'd be a good test for soldiers. If they're willing to dress as bunny girls they're probably gonna be more complacent. Yeah fuck. Someone released a bio weapon. We don't know which side. Everyone's gonna have to take daily shots now to negate its effect. Could work. How do I sign up as a prisoner of war? They've even spelled center correctly. Based and pink pilled. Imagine walking into your POW camp after a year of time away and all the inmates are in bunny suits or latex. My penis would be harder than diamonds. Traps are always been shit. Kill yourself. Sounds like someone needs to take a trip to the camp to get educated. That's basically how it worked in ancient Greece. It was only gay if you were taking it. What the entire fuck? You want it and you know you want it. Admit it. Is Satan giving you kickbacks or what? Fuck off you degenerate. This is super gay. No this is K. Only if they found out. And even then what are they going to do? Risk getting suited? No they'll volunteer. No this is Patrick. That's not too far fetched actually. The Nips just released an idol anime featuring a cast of zombies. Anon, where do you think you are? Somewhere super gay, apparently. Being able to get an erection for man ass. Not gay, man ass. After estrogen. Wrong. I'm sweetie, if your testosterone isn't as low as your IQ, you'd be hard already. I keep telling people this but they never listen. Being dominant is manly as fuck. Nothing wrong with being B, anonymous. Sure. If you like AIDS and going to hell, not everyone is a stereotype. Not sure why you would choose to be, D Sue. It's easier. He can just look at who he identifies with and pantomime his life. This makes me feel like Omama Teen. I just want to suck dick every once in a while. It's not a big deal. It's 50% gay though. Passive immunity to some political bullshit. Larger pool of candidates for long term relationships, etc. Sure thing BB. Holy shit this thread was a wild ride from start to finish. You're all heretics. Yes it was anonymous. Someone sounds bitchy. I know how we can fix that. Bump for turning POWs into latex dogs. I liked sun gears. You shall be in thine harem. Did you mean mine, Anon? No I'll be in my own harem. I really hope that none of you are in charge if a real war ever breaks out. You'll be on trial for the weirdest war crimes ever, like molesting people with gun barrels or some other niche shit. He needs the men to go on estrogen. Weak. Trial. Implying our might of monster girls and traps will be defeated. I have already won our battle of the minds, now prepare your anus. Isn't that basically what they did to Bradley Manning? You'll be on trial for the weirdest war crimes ever. Only if we lose. What would a K world look like, unashamed of its power level? What in the sweet blueberry motherfuck is this thread? Being taken alive, worse than death M8. Pups are good moral boosters, in case if we manage to turn some of them and bring them back to the front. You never know what this would actually look like in real life. You're vastly overestimating our standards. Feed that guy a little more fat and a lot more estrogen. Anything's legal as long as no lawmen hear of it. Only if you get off to it. Alright, who's volunteering for the test program? We've got to prove this works somehow. God it, K. Why must you give me fetishes for weird and gay shit? What the hell kinda name is so gay? Your face when they blow the armory guard and stage a prison break. Is this a weapon that can surpass Metal Gear? Do they get to choose if we chop the dick off or not? This was a good idea. Whatever happened to this idea? Totally off the wall idea. What if we used fursuits to demonstrate for gun rights without revealing our identities or looking like more ninja spugs? Cute and cuddly cells. Cute and cuddly cells. That might get national laws against furries enacted. They will be locked up they are prisons after all but kept. Hey it's a win-win. You give them enough estrogen and it won't matter. Combine that with daily anal training and they will become submissive pretty quick. Don't forget to lock them up. Some might like it without a dick though. We are planning on selling their services right? Can confirm. K. 
cage right now and going crazy. Would submit just to have an orgasm. 114 replied. What the fuck, eh? What the actual fuck was this thread? Like, it was fucking hilarious, don't get me wrong. But still, what the actual fuck? I love a good K thread. I need to do more of them. Um, some of my really old stuff was just K stuff. And it's one of those um, boards that I'm just not on as much as I'd like to be, you know? I really want to get back into the swing of doing more Keith threads because I think they're outstanding. Um, it was actually a Bolo Wizard that sent me this one on an end, so cheers, mate. I thought it was outstanding. It's been sitting on my to-do pile for fucking ever. So, like, sorry. I get there eventually, you know what I mean? But, like, if you have any threads yourself, just throw them on into the Discord and I'll just, I'll get there eventually. I can't tell you how long it will be, but I will get there at some point. But, also got some really cool news. I've got an affiliate with NordVPN, so that's, like, a thing. And, uh, let's face it, videos about fucking uh, POWs being forced into Eastern shots in bunny suits, it's just not very advertiser friendly, you know what I mean? It's just not. So I think it's really cool that I've actually got an affiliate now. So like links down below, NordVPN, coupon code, you know what a VPN is, you know what I mean? But coupon code, neckbeardia. Um, if you haven't already got it, I think you'd be mad not to get a VPN, especially with all that Article 13 stuff and all that jazz. But look, like, hey, you, there's no point, you know what I mean? You guys know what a fucking VPN is at this stage. Pretty much every YouTuber's got a NordVPN <laughs> affiliate, but, like, you know, if you went for my one, I'd be very happy. Like, you know, I might just suck your dick or some shit, maybe take a few estrogen shots just for you. <laughs> but, no, hey, like, boys, I'll talk to you later on. Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you soon. If you haven't already, check out my Redbubble portfolio. You might just find something you like. Just stop! Just stop it! Stop! No! Just stop it! It's time to stop! It's time to stop, okay? No more! Where the fuck are your parents? Who are your parents? I'm gonna call Child Protective Services! It's time to stop!